today we're going to show you how to land survey with your phone and in this case we are going to use to connect a GNS receiver the Tocnav T10 Pro and there it is it just came out of the blue Tocnav 10T Pro oh my god I need a rod <laughs> And, of course, it needs to get in, so turn. You see, Ma, without hands. <laughs> so, once we have this, we already mounted the mount on that. And, as what I showed you in the beginning, I have a phone. Connected to that. So, now I have to press on, on the Tocnav 10 Pro. Just get it on, just wait, and... So now I'm going to show you that it actually talks to you, and what we do, once we open the Amplos server wizard, we'll press the connection button, which looks like a chain. Then Stop! I will take it from here. <laughs> Hello guys. There is a special thing with the T10 Pro. First of all, you can select the type of GNS receiver. And as you can see in this list, there is a T10 Pro. So we select the T10 Pro and we click on this button. And then it makes con a Bluetooth connection with the T10 Pro. We have to wait a little bit. It made now a connection. And here in this screen, you can configure the T10 Pro of Tognav. You can say if it is a rover or a base, you can select the Bluetooth or a radio. If we select, for example, radio, we can send the message to this GNS receiver. And it talks, as Ray said, shut up. And then we can put it back on Bluetooth. Send the message again. And in this GNS receiver, there's also an IMU. An IMU makes sure that you can use a tilt function. And of course you can use it with tilt or without tilt. Depends what you want. So now we added the tilt function and we click OK because we configured the complete T10 Pro. After that we can fill in all the entry data or we can use server that is uh, optional for some countries. I don't like that it's talking, but maybe some people do. <laughs> I guess he does, but now that this T10 Pro is configured, we can connect it. So we click on the connect button. It made a connection and we wait and now we have a position. The position is RTK but as you can see there is a blue icon as well. So if you want to use the tilt function of this T10 Pro then Ray has a saying and he can tell that very good. He likes to move sticks. Tilt function. Normally, when I do a demo or I explain to people how to land survey, I always say, no, you have to watch this small bubble here and it should be in center and then you can press land survey. But before we use the tilt function, we need to do something. And it means you have to shake before you deliver. <laughs> Check. And yes, it is green. So it means now I can hold it in an angle. And then I can press. So as you can see, you can use your phone to do land surveying and to get 
accuracy you need a GNS receiver for example this T10 Pro which you can buy in our web store if you want to know more about GPS surveying with your phone then watch this video